I was only 16 when I first felt the river's wrath. Our village drowned, our fields swallowed whole. We called it a curse, but Li Bing, our governor, called it a challenge. He said we wouldn't stop the Min River. We'd teach it to obey. We carved a fish mouth from the mountainside, split the river in two. One to calm its rage, the other to feed the land. No dam, no iron machines, just our hands, stone, and the will to make the earth listen. We bled so our children wouldn't drown. We weren't building for the moment. We were building for the years ahead, hoping that Du Jiangyan would continue to breathe life into Sichuan long after we were gone. The river no longer rules us. We walk beside it, like an old sentinel guarding the land.